Hi, Christopher Duncan here. Today is a really special video for me. This is something that literally uh, held me back for so long. In fact, I really want to share this because for me, I wanted success. I wanted to be where I am now for so long, but there was something that was holding me back. If that's you, if there's something you've been looking for or been aiming for or wanting to achieve, whether it's a million dollars, whether it's a business, whether it's an amazing relationship, whether it's con contributing more to your family or your friends, whether it's living the life you want or having the body you deserve, if there is a goal that you've been searching for and for some reason you're not able to get there, then really be listening. In fact, I want you to listen to this more than once. It's gonna be that important. This might be the most important video of your year. Here's the thing, is when you're aiming for a goal, here's where you want to be. Now, some of us have been aiming for the same goal for so long. In fact, for years, uh, I said to myself, I would love to have a million dollars. I would love to have a million dollars. For years, I sat there going, I wish I was more confident and had a good relationship. For years, I let myself not have the body that I wanted. And here's how I did it. Is here's, here's where you are right now. And here's your goal. And what you do is you put obstacles in your way. Every single one of you has the ability to reach your goals. You have the same neurology of people that have got it. You're just as smart as people that have achieved that goal. People have come from further behind than you and are now in a place where you want to be. You can do it too. However, you must remove these obstacles. Some of us have obstacles and we actually put more and more and more obstacles in our way. We put negative beliefs in our way. We always say we need to learn more. We don't know enough. So we read book after book after book after book and we go to seminar after seminar, get more and more and more knowledge. Here's the thing, knowledge isn't the only answer. In fact, sometimes people get so consumed by seeking more and more knowledge, they never actually get to their goal, but they have a whole heap of knowledge. In fact, sometimes I've got a very good friend of mine and he knows so much stuff, but all of that knowledge actually stops him and it's a problem of overthinking. However, sometimes you may have already done a lot of work on yourself. You may have gone to a few seminars. You may have removed a lot of obstacles. You may totally believe that you can have your goal in every ounce of your body. You might know what to do and you might think you have the right psychology in order to achieve that goal. And I know this because I did too. In fact, I was already a master of NLP, a master of hypnosis. I had spent tens of thousands of dollars going to course after course after course. I had some success, but not the true success that I wanted. I wasn't right at the goal and I wasn't feeling the way I really truly wanted to feel. I wanted to feel free, I wanted to feel love, I wanted to feel passion, I wanted to feel juice in my life. However, even though I was getting further, even though I'd removed a lot of the obstacles, there was something holding me back and that's what I want to talk to you about today. The thing that holds most people back is they start getting some level of success, they make some change and this thing, this invisible sort of chain or rope or uh, magnetic force pulls them in the opposite direction. You see it when people earn a lot of money, then they give it all away. You see it when someone gets a great relationship with a great person and then somehow screws it up and ends up single. You see how someone goes and loses the weight just to put it back on again and it's a continual cycle. If you find yourself on the treadmill, then please send me a message. Let's get this handled today. Here's the problem. The problem is called ecology. Now what is ecology? It means your ecosystem that you're in doesn't support somebody having that goal. And what we code up, because we code up that success or achieving that goal will find us to be very lonely. Now as humans, there are only two real things. Out of all my studies, Jung therapy, I've gone, sorry, psychology, I've gone and say everything that I could about Freudian, every other belief, Tony Robbins, the six human needs, I've gone through all sorts of stuff. This is the thing that really changed me. When I understood and was able to get into a place where I could have my goal and I could still belong to my family ecology and I could still feel safe while achieving that success, Boom, every single thing changed for me. Everything changed. And what I want you to know, if you've removed some obstacles, if you know exactly what you need to do, but you're not doing it, then you and me need to have a conversation around how we get rid of and move this ecology for you so that you can start moving like lightning speed towards your goal and it just seems easy because there is no problem. In fact, this is the number one reason most people don't get what they want.
So please, do yourself a favor. If this is you, if this is really sounding like something that, you know, is holding you back, if for years or even months or however long it's been, you've been going to the same goal or wanting the same thing or the same feeling and you haven't got it, my suggestion is this. My suggestion is that there is something in your unconscious, in your ecology, that says, if I get that, I'm going to lose rapport with those I love. And here's the thing, is if you don't change that, you'll find yourself going and then pull back, going and then pull back, because there is nothing a human brain wants to do, anything less than break rapport with their family. Have a wonderful day. If this has sparked your interest, send me a message. Let's talk about it more. Have an awesome day. Have a great week. Smash it.